school favorites. Michael, Operator M's green, likes to play the tunes the way he first discovered them, on vinyl. I do embrace technology. I mean, I own all the new gadgets. I play out at other events with my computer, but it's nothing like touching that vinyl and putting a needle on there. It makes me feel like I'm a kid, because that is the first way I play music. <laughs> first time I probably got on the set and learned how to DJ was 1980, the Northeast Bronx. Operator M's has had a successful career in the music industry, DJ, producing, and more. But in 2011, his love of the 45 led him to start Mobile Mondays, an all-vinyl night downtown at Bowery Electric. In 2015, the idea expanded to include this free Thursday night outdoor dance party on 33rd Street, outside of Madison Square Garden. The crowd loves what we do. They love the fact that we are passionate enough to carry these heavy records out. They love it that we're playing the music that they remember the way it was sold to them. On a good night, anywhere from 600 to 1,000 people, Ems is joined by other like-minded DJs, including Misbehavior. When we start playing, one thing I notice is that you'll see certain people doing the hustle. <laughs> Pretty classic New York. I don't see that so much in England when I play out there. The DJs really tell the story um, with the music. About, about the history of New York and all the artists that performed here. 70s, 80s, 90s, disco, house, punk and soul, hip hop. How many records did you bring? This is around 300, I think. I'll probably play around 40. How many do you own in total? Around 10,000. When I see people out here vibing to the music we play, that makes me know that New York City's still alive. The music continues through September 13th. Stephanie Simon, New York One. It is 727, another...